Okay, Shalom, Shalom, Israel. Before I start this lesson, I'm going to give our honor, glory, and praise to Yahweh, Ba Hashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba Hashem, I'm the brother Tazim Makamath, coming from the Camp Prophets in Babylon here in Tampa, Florida. I want to give double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone that teach us truth and well. Peace and citation to the hopeful let that scatter abroad. And what I have today, man, is Eve, man. See, Eve got to go, bro. This says, woman posts video indo indoctrinating her baby to be happy. Okay? Man, look, bro. We in the month of June, okay? And it's already showing pure wickedness. Okay? It's already showing pure wickedness. Let's, uh, let's actually open up with this first scripture. All right, this is Second Ezra 15, verse 6, when it says, For, for wickedness have exceedingly polluted the whole earth, and their hurtful works are fulfilled. Hey, bro, look, pure wickedness is exceeding the whole earth, and because of Eve, man. Eve, all because of her. Let's actually open up. Let's get this other scripture. Um, Cause ain't nothing more wicked than a woman. All right, but let's play this video. Gay baby, it's a gay baby, gay baby, gay, 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 please be gay. <laughs> oh. Okay. Be what you want to be, but be gay, okay? Thank you. <laughs> right? No pressure. No pressure, but pressure. Let's play this again. Hey, baby. It's a gay baby. Gay baby. Gay, gay, gay. Please be gay. <laughs> oh. Okay. Be what you want to be, but be gay. Okay? Thank you. <laughs> right? No pressure. <laughs> No pressure, but pressure. <clears throat> All right. Man, look, bro. Let's actually grab this, too. This is Second Ezra 14 and 17. And it says, For look how much the world shall be weaker through age. So much the more shall evils increase upon them that dwell therein. All right. And as the world... <clears throat> gets weak is because of Esau Edom, the so-called white man running this earth, okay? As the world gets weaker through age, all right, so much more the evils increase upon them that dwell therein. And as we read in the previous chapter, that wickedness have exceedingly polluted the whole earth. Evils, this mean bad times, all right? This is a bad time, man, okay? All right, we in a month of June where this whole month is dedicated to these people. All right, this is a sodomite, man. All right, she indoctrinating her kids. This is why Uganda, okay, is pushing that death penalty upon people like this. But in America, you could be whatever you want. You could, she said, oh, you could be whatever you want. Just be G-A-Y. Oh, I hope that you're G-A-Y. You see? Because they're going to indoctrinate this child to be that way. See, that being, being uh, you know, a sodomite, a mo, it, it, man, you have demons on you. Hella demons. Okay? All right? Ain't nobody born that way. 
No, you have demons hopping on you to make you that way. That's why you have women, you know, changing their sex, want to be men. And men trying to be women, cutting off their rods and changing their sex. Just like Apostle Paul mentioned in Romans, the first chapter. Okay? But you see, women, Eve, our people, man. Alright? Are pushing the agenda of Esau to make it easier for them. Alright? Let's get this. Sirach 25 and 19. And it says, all wickedness, right? All wickedness. Think of the most wickedest thing. All wickedness is but little to the wickedness of a woman. Let the portion of a sinner fall upon her. All right, but all wickedness is but little to the wickedness of a woman okay all wickedness is little but to the wickedness of a woman all right and through her a hey, through the woman we all die let's see if i can grab that all right same chapter let's go to verse 24 all right and it says, of the woman came the beginning of sin, right? Because when Adam and Eve was in the garden, all right, Eve talked to that serpent, which that serpent is Esau, right? <clears throat> she was commanded not to go over there and talk to that serpent. And guess what? The serpent beguiled her, deceived her, all right, and brought it back to Adam, which made us fall, <clears throat> Because the women are the weaker, <clears throat> so lucky it says the because the women are the weaker vessel. Okay, that's why I say him, you know, he will come to your woman before he come to you. All right, because the woman gonna get all wild up and you know do things Satan want. And guess what? This is a prime example, bro. She got demons on her, bro. The lie of the body is the eyes, man. You could just tell. All right? When you play this video again, we could just tell. Gay baby. It's a gay baby. Gay baby. Gay, gay, gay. Please be gay. <laughs> oh. Okay. Be what you want to be, but be gay. Okay? Thank you. <laughs> right? They got demons on her. Alright. Let's read it. Um, Sirach, chapter 25, verse 24, it says, Of the woman came the beginning of sin, right? And through her, we all die. Okay? And through her, we all die. See? See, the reason why we in the state is because of the woman, Eve. Okay? It's crazy, man. Let's see if I can grab this one scripture. Let's go to the book of, uh, let's get this scripture right here. This is Proverbs 11 and 21. Though hand join in hand, the wicked shall not be unpunished, but the seed of the righteous shall be delivered. Okay? The reason why I brought this scripture is because what? This is fulfilling Esau's agenda. Okay? Esau promotes this. Esau promotes a whole month dedicated to these people. Esau has laws protecting them. Okay? This woman is a sodomite. And guess what? What happens to them? They're gonna be they're gonna be burned, man. Same thing as Sodom and Gomorrah, bro. See, this place this place America is gonna <laughs> is gonna get destroyed. It's going to get destroyed. <clears throat> because Revelation eleven and eight it said this is spiritually Sodom and Egypt. What was happening in Sodom and Gomorrah? 
whole bunch of mo, man on man, woman on woman, whole bunch of that stuff happening there. But see, people like this, hey, they join the hands with the devil. And guess what? The wicked shall not be unpunished, all right? So just how Esau's going to get punished by nuclear fire, you know, the two-thirds are going to get punished the same way. Because guess what? When the Lord lo looks down, he looks as he looks as you as an Edomite. All right, what just with dark skin, an Edomite with dark skin. That's how he looks at you. Okay, all right. So though hand joining hand, the wicked shall not be unpunished, but the seed of the righteous shall be delivered. Now let's go to Ecclesiastes seven. Because when uh, King Solomon tried to find a virtuous woman, he could not find one. Right here, let's open, let's open up with this. Ecclesiastes 7 and 26. And I find more bitter than death the woman whose heart is snares and nets. Flock it. Flock it. Ecclesiastes 7 and 26. And I find more better than death the woman whose heart is snares and nets, and her hands is bands. Whoso pleases the Most High shall escape from her, but the sinner shall be taken by her. All right, so the woman is as deaf. Yeah. Oh. Let's lock it. All right, and guess what? King Solomon said he's finding more bitter than death the woman. This woman is promoting death. Okay, her mind, her mind is snares and nets. How to trap you, how to get you. Alright. Reading on. It says, Behold, this have I found. Save the preacher counting one by one to find out the account. Which yet my soul seeketh, but I find not. It's like it. One man among a thousand have I found, but a woman among all those have I not found. All right, so when King Solomon was counting the men, he found one righteous out of a thousand. He found one righteous out of a thousand, but a woman he found zero. All right, that's why, you know, they're as they're equal as death. They're more bitter, you know. They're wicked because. You know, they're the weaker vessel. <laughs> Lock it, man. Yeah. Let's get this. Job 39 and 17. It says, Because the Most High have deprived her of wisdom, neither have you imparted to her understanding. And guess what? The Lord had deprived women of wisdom understanding all right because they see esau doing it they think it's okay for them to do it all right and of course it'll be the eve you know the southern kingdom head tribe because everything follows after the head tribe bro all right as you can see you want to have parades you want to have marching all from this month, okay. Let's get this. So, rock ten in verse, we start verse one. It says, A wise judge will instruct his people, and the government of a prudent man is well ordered, okay. And guess what? That wise judge is going to come very soon. Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Shai will, you know, put everything back in order. Okay, have righteousness back on the earth. 
Oh, what happened? Oh. Why have everything? Why have everything in a set order right back on the earth? Because guess what? This devil is destroying it. Okay. Verse two: As the judge of the people is himself, so are his officers. And what manner of a man the ruler of the city is, so are, such are all they that dwell therein. Okay. And guess what? The judge of the people is himself. All right. You see, Esau, he's just like. He's the one that promotes this. He's. He's the one that's, that likes this stuff, man. And guess what? All the people that live upon that earth, upon his kingdom, are like him. That's why you see women and men promoting this. You got Target promoting this. All right, all these different companies, these stores, is because guess what? The judge of the people, is, as the judge of the people is himself, so are his officers. All right, and what manner of the man the ruler of the city is, such are all they that dwell therein. All right, so this king, Esau, which he runs the earth right now, all right, this is his kingdom, okay? He's the one that ruled the city. All right, and guess what? All the people are going to be like him. All right, and that's why, that's why uh, <clears throat> our Lord, Yehawah Bashem Yahushai, took away Enoch, because this shit was getting wicked. All right, and if, if the Lord didn't take Enoch, guess what? He was going to turn out like them. That's why it tells you in Matthew 24, you know, um, um, the Lord speed up the days for the elect's sake, all right? Because if not, no flesh will be saved, roughly paraphrasing, man. All right, because we got to get out of this kingdom. This is this, this vexing, this, this shit. Would destroy destroy people. That this brings diseases, you know, death. All right, and Esau is as deaf as the scripture tells you. Okay. Let's see. And we need our Lord to come back to destroy this wicked ruler. All right. Verse three: An unwise king destroyeth his people. All right. This unwise king will be Esau because guess what? He is the base man, the base man that rules the earth. All right. It says, but through the prudence of them, which are in authority, the city shall be inhabited. Okay. And guess what? The wise man is going to inherit and, uh, and, and authorize the city. When our Lord comes back, how about Shemuel Shai? Verse four, it says, the power of the earth is in the hand of the Lord. And in due time, he will set over it one that is profitable. Okay? And that will be starting with our Lord, Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Shai first, then the elect. Okay? But this woman, bro, she gotta fucking die, bro. Bro, this is not, this is not right. This is not right at all. Okay? But guess what? Hey, this is hey, this is gonna be an example of, of Sodom and Gomorrah. How it was burned with fire. Okay. And guess what? Everything nothing new is under the sun. Alright, because as the days of Noah, people were marrying, giving in marriage, drinking, okay, and they were being wicked. Sodom and Gomorrah, they were being wicked. Alright? During the time of Enoch, they were being wicked. Guess what? The Lord the Lord destroyed all that shit. Okay, and saved the righteous. And this is what we have to be saved from, bro. Because we're the ones that, that sign and cry for all the abominations thereof. These other people ain't crying and sign. Alright, for, uh, for the wickedness they see. For the abomination they see. Okay. So with that, Lord willing, less than been edifying. I want to give our honor, glory, and praise to Yahweh, Bashim Yahshah, Bashim Rukhakadash. Till next time, I say Shalom.